first on four, the director of the FBI, James Comey, made his first visit to the Valley and is addressing a major issue involving elected officials. Action 4's Ashley Custer was at the McKellen Field Office. She has the latest. FBI Director James Comey is just two years into his term. He was sworn in as the seventh director of the FBI back in September 2013. Comey says his first visit to the Rio Grande Valley was not only to meet with local and state law enforcement partners, but also to meet with agents working diligently to investigate crimes that range from kidnappings to public corruption. And whenever you have people in positions of power, you have the potential for public corruption, just given the nature of human beings. It's why the FBI initiated a public corruption task force back in November. However, Comey says while there have been several public officials recently indicted and sentenced to federal prison over the last few years in the Rio Grande Valley, corruption is everywhere. That combination of people and power inevitably leads to our having to do this work. It's the reason we've done it for 100 years. My experience is that it tends to go in waves, that communities will develop a significant amount of it. Then we have to stand up task forces, be aggressive, beat it back, and then it will go down. And then if we don't keep our eye on it, it will come back up again. When we looked at the problem, we felt the problem was a big problem down here. So we moved agents around, and then we created a very specific public corruption task force. So we applied more agents to the problem, and we got the other agencies to come on board. The FBI says the public is also a big partner in combating public corruption. It makes a difference. When people call into the tip line, we take it very seriously, and we go after these, these cases. And because of the public, we have opened a number of cases. And the FBI says it doesn't plan on letting up anytime soon. It feels the best way to tackle public corruption is head on. I'm hoping we'll send a message as we try and send around the country that if you are tempted, to take money by virtue of your position of authority, we will lock you up. You will be very sorry that you made that decision. In McAllen, Ashley Custer, Action 4 News. So anyone with information who would like to contact the FBI can call their 24-hour, seven-day-a-week tip line at 210, that is 225-6741.